All right, so I also have this little lamp that I picked up from Target last year. I wanna say it was like $10. And I have seen people use these lamps in their kitchens or other small spaces. So I think this would be perfect to use in my kitchen for fall. You know, to create that warm ambiance in the evening just to have a little lamp on. So, you know what I'm gonna do, right? Yep, we're gonna spray paint it too. Let's fly you away, just you and me. I need a little break from the city. It's been so long since we've been gone. feel but I don't want to go if you ain't with me let's make a home be all alone so tell me baby where would you like to go maybe we'll drive from coast to coast only to where we love the most I'm taking you to paradise paradise Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. So today I thought we would do a little pre-fall decorating. It is a gloomy day outside, it's raining and it's a balmy 78 degrees. <laughs> but I thought it would be the perfect day to do a little pre-fall decorating. Think today what we are going to do is to style my coffee bar. I thought it would be fun to bring in a little warm gold brassy tones to my coffee bar and so I thought I would take you along with me today and if we have time if we have time we might just do a simple tablescape so if you're looking for a little fall decorating inspiration and you want to do it all on a budget well this is the channel for you so make sure you keep watching and make sure you give the video a thumbs up. It helps YouTube know that you are liking the content so they push it out to more viewers. A lot of you guys really love my bringing warmth into fall or bringing warmth into fall. Yeah, bringing warmth for fall, bringing in warmth. <laughs> bringing in warmth for fall my bathroom video my powder room you guys really love that video if you missed that video i will leave that linked in the description box down below showed you guys how i am bringing in warm golds and brassy tones to make my home all warm and cozy for fall so if you like that vibe and you're looking for a little inspiration and you want to bring that warmth and cozy vibe into your home for fall, well, this is the channel for you. So make sure you hit that subscribe button, tap the notification bell, become a member of the I Style My Style family. Now, let's go style the coffee bar for fall. All right, so here is how the coffee bar is currently looking. This is how we set it up for summer. I picked up these florals from Hobby Lobby and we did a tropical theme for fall and this is what I did for the coffee bar. So now we're going to change it up and bring in that warm, cozy vibe for fall. All right, so for me, Bringing in fall is about bringing in that warm and cozy vibe. And I like to do that with my fall scents. So the first thing we are going to do is a little cleaning with some Mrs. Myers. This is a corn spice. And then if you have not found this, I don't know where you have been, but this stuff smells so awesome. It's a warm and toasty, just a really good fall scent. So if you have not picked this up, run to your nearest Target and pick this up. I think they're like four or $5. So perfect value for your, for your buy. So first we're going to clean up. And I wish you guys were here. I know my boyfriend always teases me 
because I talk about smell of vision <laughs> but it does smell so so nice so we're just going to take everything off and give it a quick wet down to get it ready for our fall decorating. Or should I say pre-fall decorating. Containers came from Z Gallery. You guys know I love Z Gallery. This little thing I use as a tray. It actually came from the Target Bullseye Playground. It's like a little grill. <laughs> I don't know if you can see that, but. I just painted it and I use it as a little tray and I keep my smeg tea kettle on it like so it's back up there all right so now I think we're ready to decorate so the first thing I want to do um, I had a floral arrangement here before I think what I'm going to do, let's bring back our canisters first. I need to get some Splenda to go in that one. So there's that. You bring you a little closer so you can see. better for you or maybe I should bring you over this way all right so there's that and then I think I want to add in well let's do something a little different shall we so I have this lamp here I picked this up from Target last year, it was $12. And since we're bringing in the warm gold brassy tones, I think this will be cute to set here to bring in the warmth for fall. And I could plug it in or I could put in one of those pop lights so you can't see the cord because I'm gonna have to try to camouflage the cord a little bit because I don't want to see it. And then, and this, I already had this little gold spoon. You can see that, so, so pretty. So we don't have to change that. So the spoon matches our little lamp here. And then I think the next thing I want to bring in, I, oh, hold on. Okay, so, I picked the this little thing up from the spring shop last year. It was $14.99. And I want to say I got it when it was 75% off. And I think it's so cute. And it's this little tray. It's black and gold. And it comes with this little teacup. I picked up two of these, so I think what I'm going to do is take this little teacup and I'm going to set him right over here to give me a pop of gold on that side. And then I'm going to bring in the candle that we made the other the other day so if you missed that video I will leave that linked 
in the description box down below and in the iCards above so you can check that out as well. But I also have these little syrup bottles that have the gold and brass pour spouts. And I think this would be perfect here on the coffee bar for fall. So I'm gonna set the other one like right here toward the front with our syrup. And I like for everything, sorry for the noise, to point in the same direction. So I like that. And then I think I'm gonna take this candle that we made and I'm gonna set it back over there in the corner to balance that out. So I think that works and then we'll bring back our okay. But first coffee and then we have our lid for the candle. And I think that looks really cute. What do you guys think? Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think and we can turn on our little light. I don't know if you can see that because of the window behind me, but I just think it is so cute. Let me give you a closer look. So this is how our coffee bar is looking for fall. And I love the warmth that the brassy gold tones have brought to this area. I love this little tray with a little espresso cup. The syrup bottles look so nice here. And the lamp, I absolutely love it. So now I just need to get, I, I'm thinking a puck light to go in there because um, I don't want to string the cord over here because I don't think it would look very nice. And then I think I need to find something else that is like a brassy gold tone to go over in this corner to tie the whole space together. But so far, I, I am absolutely loving how this has turned out. So leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think. And if you are enjoying the video so far, make sure you give the video a thumbs up. And if you have not yet subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button for more fall decorating inspiration. So I changed up the look just a little bit. I moved this from the front to the middle. I moved these over to the side and then I brought the candle up. And I don't know, I think I might like this setup a little bit better. What do you think? Was the first setup the one? Or is the second setup the perfect look? Do you vote number one? or do you vote number two? So this is how our fall coffee bar is looking. I think it brings in the perfect amount of warmth and color to this space. So now let's dial the dining room table. All right, so now we are going to style the dining room table. And first, I'm going to take off this and you guys saw me spray paint these guys. I am loving the spray paint that I picked up. I think it's the perfect color for fall in a very budget friendly way for you to DIY some budget friendly inexpensive fall decor for your home. Okay, so we're gonna take off this tablecloth. It's a little crummy. And I'm just gonna give it a really 
nice white dish. So we're going to do a really simple tablescape. Nothing big, nothing over the top, just something really simple. So the first thing we're gonna start with is our table runner. And this table runner, oh gosh, I picked up two or three years ago and I got it from Amazon and I picked it up because I want it a black velvet table runner for Christmas. And that's what I initially got it for. And I love the detail. And because we are bringing in those warm tones for fall, I thought this would be perfect. As you could see the brown tones in there, kind of a brassy brown. I thought it would be perfect for fall. So we are going to use this table runner. And it had some tassels on it, but they came off in the wash. So we're <laughs> just gonna use it the way it is. And then I showed you guys these really pretty charger plates that I picked up from Amazon. These are from E Favor Mart, I think. They were like $13 for six and with like $4 shipping. So I didn't think that was too bad a deal. And I just love the detail. And again, it's bringing in that warm, brassy gold tone. So I am going for And it has been a minute since I actually did a tablescape. So it'll be fun to do one. So then I think I'm going to bring back in this simple brass colored tray for the center. I don't want to make anything too elaborate. We will do something more elaborate for fall as we get closer. And now we need to get out our plates. All right, I'm gonna keep this simple. And we're just gonna use some plates that I purchased from the Dollar Tree. When they were just a dollar, if you were to buy them now, it would be a dollar 25. And at the time, they were just one dollar. So our charger plates were eighteen dollars shipped, and now we have our dollar twenty-five plates. And now we're going to add our pretty plates that we got from Sea Gallery. And I think this looks so so pretty. And these were a clearance find. These were normally $39, and I want to say we got them for $23. And they look so nice here on the table. Let me show you. Look how pretty that is. So, so pretty. Don't mind my dinner plates. These are plates that we use on the daily. So they do have little fork and knife scrapes, but this is just to give you an idea of how you can put together a fall tablescape that is very budget friendly. So our charger, as I said, was $18 shipped. There are six of them, so they cost us about $3. So that's $3, the Dollar Tree plate is $4, 
This plate also probably around $3. So $8 total for this elegant and sophisticated place setting. Yeah, I'm here for it. Hope you are as well. And if you are inspired by today's video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Now let's get our silverware and our drinkware. And here is our really pretty gold silverware. I picked this up from Amazon. Now I've had this silverware. You guys know I told you I was on the hunt for some gold silverware. And I picked this up a couple of years ago from Amazon and I picked it up for Thanksgiving. But as you can see, it hasn't held up very well. And I haven't um, picked up new gold silverware yet. So for this demonstration, we're just gonna use these. But if they weren't tarnished, you could see how really pretty they would look here on the table setting. So let's go ahead and put these down. And then I also have these really pretty wine goblets. I picked these up from the Goodwill oh, two or three years ago, but I could only find three. So I had to supplement. I found one at Hobby Lobby and I'm on the hunt for a couple of more. Um, so, but this is what our glassware is looking like and Sorry for the poor lighting, but as you can see, our tablescape's coming together. So let's put our silverware down. All right, so first we're gonna put down the rest of our dinner napkins. And we're going to use these really pretty napkin rings that I picked up from Hobby Lobby. These were 66% off and they were like $3.99, $4.99, $5.99, something like that. So Hobby Lobby is still having their sale. So you might be able to still pick something up. So I am loving how the silverware is looking. It, or not the silverware, the napkin rings. It matches perfectly with our dinner plates. So, so pretty. Give 
about the price, yeah, yeah Paradise, paradise I'm taking you Let's see the sun and have some fun I'm so tired of living Alright guys, so this is how our tablescape turned out and I am loving the warm ambiance that the table is giving. The perfect tablescape for fall and I hope you guys agree. Again, I apologize for the lighting. It is not the best lighting, the best time of day. It was gloomy when we started, but it's not gloomy anymore. So I hope you can appreciate how beautiful the tablescape is looking. Let me give you a different angle to see if that would be any better. We look at it from this angle. Absolutely love it and it ties in perfectly with the warmth that we have brought into the coffee bar. So again, I will leave linked anything that I purchased from Amazon in my Amazon store so you can go check it out. You can shop my Amazon store 24 seven. When you do, I do get a very small commission. So I hope you would go check that out to show a little support. And these candle holders, oh my gosh, I am absolutely loving the ambiance they are bringing to the table. And these came from Kirkland's. They were actually part of their Christmas line. And it just goes to show you, you can pick up items and use them any day or any holiday of the week or any season. So absolutely love. So guys, if you have enjoyed today's video, I would so appreciate it if you would give it two big thumbs up. And if you are new here, welcome. My name is Cheryl. I love decorating with style on a budget and I love to try to make my home look a lot more expensive than it really is. And one of the ways I do that is by budget decorating. And as you can see, we put, to, we put together this beautiful tablescape all on a budget. Again, our place setting cost us $8. Our napkins, they came from Amazon. I wanna say they were probably around $12. So $2 a piece. Our glasses here, these two glasses also came from the Goodwill. I had to supplement because I did not have enough gold glasses. They also came from the Goodwill and one came from Hobby Lobby. I think they were like $7.99 and when they are in stock, you can get them at 40% off. So I need to run to Hobby Lobby to see if I can pick up some more to complete my glass set. Um, these candle holders, again, came from Kirkland's on clearance. Um, I don't think they are available any longer. I'm sad to say, but hopefully you might be able to find something similar. The tray also came from Kirkland's on clearance. It was like um, a little pricey, probably the priciest thing on the table at $25. But I absolutely love the look. So leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think of our warm fall tablescape and what you think. Let me know what you think of the warmth that we brought into our coffee bar for fall. I absolutely love both and I hope you do as well. So guys, yeah, absolutely love. I wish it was a little dimmer in here. Oh my gosh, could you feel the ambiance? Could you feel it? Oh my gosh. So love, 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 and I hope you do too. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and I hope to see you in the next one. I'm taking you to paradise, paradise. I don't even care about the price, care about the price, yeah. Paradise, paradise.